Last night, I was watching a movie entitled Venom. And what was really catches me on the eye was the title reveal. It really interests me so I have to recreate it in my own version using After Effects. I really like watching that movie so guys today, I will show you how to create a Venom title reveal with my own version inside After Effects. We are already inside After Effects and as you can see in here, I already made these compositions and the settings of this are all the same. 1920 by 1080p, 30 frames per second, 20 seconds duration and the background is black. And I also made a folder in project file and I put all the compositions inside this folder as you can see in here I also imported the assets that I'm gonna be using in this project so now I will grab the text tool I will type Venom I'm using the font Abaddon as you can see in here and the size is 120 pixels and I will click the align tool, center it horizontally, and center it vertically. And I will go to the reflection comp, go to layer, new solid, and I will call this reflection. Go to effects and preset, go to noise and grain and choose this one fractal noise i will change the fractal type to max then go to transform and check this uniform scaling and go to scale height and make this one 10,000 I'm gonna make sure that this plate is at the beginning. I'm gonna click the stopwatch on evolution to create the keyframe and the offset turbulent and move forward to about 20 seconds. I will change the evolution to 180 degrees and the offset turbulence to 1700. I will also make sure that my bit here is 8 bit per channel. And then after that, I will go to main, open the comps, drag down the logo to my timeline and the reflection. And then, if you will not see this track mat here, you can toggle switches in here. I will change the track mat to alpha mat and go to effects and preset go to a stylize and cc glass to make it look metallic i will change some settings in here i will change the bump map to logo and then change the softness for about 40 and the height is 30 And I will go to shading and I will make this zero ambient. The diffuse is zero. And I will make the specular 100. The roughness is 0 0.5. And I will make this metal zero. And go to 
effects and preset distort and find tc globalize change settings in here from reflection to logo and then change the softness to about 30 and the shading is the same the cut away probably is zero I will move my place at the last and make a keyframe on the light height by checking the stopwatch and go back to the beginning and I will just change this to negative 37 so the text here is gone already and that's what we want when we scrub it there's a reveal title there already I will duplicate these two layers Control D and highlight the bottom reflection and I will change the color to red look at the light color is red now so if we will put our playhead here still it's hard to see the red but all we have to do is to go to the logo highlight it and go to effects and preset and I will have to find CC radial blur and change the type to fading zoom and then change the amount to negative 30 or maybe negative 35 And then I will make another layer called null object. I will highlight these four layers and I will parent it to the null object and press scale on the null object and create a keyframe and go to 20 seconds and I will change this scale to 200 and now I will go back to my project file close the comps open the folder asset and drop down my optical flare and go to effects and preset color correction and find cc toner i will change this mid tone to red i will also change the highlights to light red And then right click and then go to time enable time remapping and adjust this layer up to the 20 seconds and then move the keyframe here too and move forward to 20 seconds and then made this add 
So now as we play this one, nice eh? Now I will open the final composition and close this asset folder. Open the comps folder and I will drag down the main. So this is it guys and our tutorial is done for today and I hope you guys will learn something from it and don't forget to subscribe and like or even comment below if you want to so my thoughts for today is think whatever makes you truly happy to think thank you guys for watching and thank you very much for subscribing see you next time on my next video god bless